Welcome back, LSU defensive coordinator Dave Aranda on the practice field today. Dave, great to see you, by the way. Oh, it's great to be here. The Saints have been great to us, so it's great to have the invite to come down. Are you, are you technically back to work, or do no. you call it practice day one, which would be a little over a week now? No, yeah, we're out. Um, this next week is uh, the coaches are in, and the players have a little bit of time off, and then we come back Friday, um, and we start it up on Saturday. So we've got a, about five days or so to get going. Dave, when you come to an NFL practice like this, what, what are you looking for? Is there something in, in your brain that, that has a, a, a list per se of I need to check this and this and this, or do you let it come to you? What do you take away from these things? No, well, there's defenses that you know are being run, and so you want to be able to see adjustments and, and um, the language that's being said. And you know, We're doing the same thing. Is there a better way to say it? Is there a better way to rep it when you're watching it repped on film? Is there a better way to teach it when you're watching the individual individual drills? So like the scheme is one thing, but then you can pick up also as a coach like how uh, Coach Allen kind of handles the group or how uh, Coach Nolan uh, interjects and gets coaching points in and out. And can you think of something in your coaching career that you saw at a practice that you studied and, and incorporated into your daily routine with your guys? Can oh, you yeah. think of anything in particular? Oh, yeah. You know, the, um, I remember I, I visited in Baltimore Ravens, and it was Coach Nolan, and Brian Billick was the head coach at the time. And so I remember I'm on, I'm, um, I'm on the sidelines there, and Coach Billick came up and talked about uh, a technique that Ray Lewis uses and I never heard of that technique, and then I talked to Coach Noel about it, oh yeah, and then we ended up putting it in at Houston, and that helped us, but that was just a side conversation. And so there's always, when you're around football, there's always things you can take from it, keep your eyes wide open. Dave, we got a couple of Tigers on the Saints preseason roster. I know they've played on the other side of the ball as you, but you know what can you share about a guy like Will Clapp or Traven Doral? Well, Will is very intelligent, he's very tough. I mean, Will, um, the last two years I was there made all of our calls up front. And so he was able to, to see stuff that was coming. He was able to be in the film room with our online coach and our offensive coordinator. And, and he was more or less an OC on the field in terms of his communication. And then, you know, when you watch him run and open up, I mean, he can, he can uh, reach a linebacker that's a 30 on the other side of it. And so it's a lot of positive things. And then you know, Trayvon's got great ability to uh, make plays in space. And, He's got great length, and so this, I mean, I'm really proud of the, of the two Tigers that we have here. What are you excited about, about this year's edition of that side of the football, and what's still keeping you up at night here a week away from training camp? Well, I'm excited about the returners that we've got. I think we've got some people that have played some, some football coming back, which is nice to have. And so the, there's a great um, uh, familiar, uh, familiar uh, approach between the players and the coaches, between the players and the calls that we have and the adjustments that we have, they know kind of where we're coming from. And so I think that's, that's, a, that's a strength. We can add more and do a little bit more because of that. So I'm excited about that. I think the stuff that's going to be concerning to see kind of as it goes is the depth in the back end. I think we've got a lot of, we've got great ability there. Just there's guys that haven't played. And so to, to put them in as much game-like situations as possible and create really good depth in terms of roles for guys, that's going, to, that's going to be a little bit of a wait and see. Coach, great to have you here on our campus today. Good luck to you guys starting next week. Appreciate it. Thank you.